Hi, my name is Sarah. I'm a filmmaker and today I'm going to be reacting to Stay Tonight by Chungha. I am filming this video, also Candy by Baekhyun and Bullet to the Heart by Jackson, all three of them consecutively because I put up a poll and I don't know which one you are choosing. I don't know when you're seeing this. Could be months from today. Today is May 27th, just as a reference that nobody cares about. I don't know a lot about Chungha. I know the song Gotta Go. I know the video to it as well. I know the song snapping. I haven't, I'm not sure if I heard the whole song. I have definitely not seen the whole video, but from what I've heard, it's not like my favorite song. So I, that's why I don't remember if I've heard the whole song. Um, so I'm also not planning on reacting to that anytime soon because I'm just not really a fan of the song. I don't know why. Gotta Go is amazing though. I love Gotta Go. Honestly, I don't really know what else to say because I really don't know much about Chungha at all. I don't know how old she is. I don't know if she's always been a solo singer or if she was in a group at some point. Uh, I just know that I love Gotta Go. So yeah. But before I get into this reaction, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. I literally have nothing else to say. So... Oh, there are no subtitles, so I am thinking the song might be English. Otherwise, I'll have to look them up afterwards. Let's do it. I don't. I have no idea what to expect at all. Go. Wait. Okay. Oh, this is giving me oh my god vibes. It's not English. Sing a lot, I'm just Ooh. Cool. Nice. Change on the color of the bars. So good. Oh, nice. I feel attacked. Damn her voice. Whoa. Nice. Oh, I like this part a lot.
That was really fast. That felt really short. Nice. I like the song. I think the more I listen to the song, I'm gonna like it even more. Because I was a little... I wasn't sure where it was going in the first... Like, the this first time that I listened to it. I really liked the video a lot. I feel like I didn't really say a lot during my reaction. But I was just paying attention. It. I think it's relatively simple. I think it's just it's mostly on location it's crazy lighting a few very dominant set pieces or like they use the dancers at like as set pieces and that's it as far as i remember this is such a cool opening it reminds me just a little bit of um kick it because i just watched that like a few days ago and it's yellow and black <laughs> i said yellow and black why didn't I say black and yellow? Oh, that's why it reminds me of Kick It. That's really the only reason. This reminds me a little bit of Skeleton. That's uh, so that's something. I like the bangs on her. I like the makeup. I like the lighting. I like this match cut. <laughs> I like the smoke. I like everything. Oh, oh, look at the light. Oh, look at how the light is like. Wait, you didn't see it because I paused it. Like it's like a coming from a broad spot like to like a stream and then back again, like here. Cool. Nice match cut, nice match cut. The lights again, that's so nice. I've never seen that before, I feel like. They changed the black bars to white here. I'm usually not a big fan of white, um, how do you even call this, bars? Because I feel it's personally to me, it's a little distracting. That's just a personal preference. This is one of the dominant set pieces I was talking about, which is fucking cool. Like that's such a cool set piece. This is like a very big set, not set, uh, like location. It was like a studio. So they probably built all of this then, maybe? Maybe it's already there, I'm not sure. It's impressive either way. Like it looks really great. I kind of wish the lighting was a little more focused as in the other one here. Sorry, lady that I paused on this. Let me go further. Um, because, I don't know, this to me looks a little bit like a dance practice video because it, everything is so evenly lit compared to all the other scenes that we saw before. But again, that's just a personal preference. I just feel like it would look cooler if the lighting was a little less even. This is really cool. Are they CGI? Because the shadows are so realistic. Are they realistic? I'm not sure. For some reason, I feel like these are practical, but then they look a little CGI. Because they're so smooth. There's no texture that I can see. So I wouldn't know what they would make, the, make these out of for them to look this smooth. Um, so I feel like there's probably CGI, I'm guessing. I don't, I don't really know. I like all of the cuts, like the the framing, the different framing they're using. Choreo is amazing. Styling, I like this. This outfit is my favorite with the whatever this is called, like the diamond crop top. No, net, whatever. And the pants, but they're light. I'm so confused about these boxes in the back. Are they practical or not? That's a cool transition. Let me see that again. Light beam comes in on this already. Oh, it does. It's just transition. Okay. I like this too. Looks like a club to me. I didn't realize those were people. I love that this is upside down. Also, it's two shots because she's she's like down here already, but here she's still up. So that's cool. Also, I feel like the person with the bald head is here in the other one. Are they? I don't know. That's a little confusing. Or maybe she's just lying flat on the floor and there are no people at all there. It's a, Anyways, it's really cool. F crazy, cool using people or dancers as set pieces. I love that part. This reminds me a little bit of Solar, Spit It Out, because I just watched that. <laughs> Choreography, I would break my everything if I did that. I still don't know if these are real or not. <laughs> the lights and the, like the boxes and the, you know, I think they are real. Are they real? I, th I just think they're real because you can see down here when the light comes on, there's actually a change. I feel like that's a lot of work if those were CGI. I feel like it would be a lot of work to make sure the shadows work and not look real, but also the light comes on and hits the right place. I feel like it's just a lot of work. So they might be practical, but I can't see how they're suspended at all. And again, they look so textureless. So I don't know. 
But no, it has to be real. Maybe it's just green boxes and they impose the rest on it, like it's green screen. Could be, maybe. Um, here you can see there's shadow of them dancing on it, so I think they are practical. But something's weird about them. Like this transition, love the lighting in this. The colors, the white and the purple, black, black, purple, blue, and orange, super pretty. I think that's the same set as before. So see this, per I prefer this lighting so much more over the one where everything is evenly lit. Because this is the same location as the previous one where I was talking about that. Like that transition of everything going red and then it cuts into the scene where everything is red. Really cool. Yeah, I get, I'm getting a little like, oh my god vibes. Sometimes I love these cuts so much. I don't know. I'm a little confused on the blue to red light if it's actually a cut. Or, like, this is a cut, obviously, but this? I'm not sure. I'll be able to tell in editing. Also, I could just slow it down, then I'll be able to see. Yeah, I think it is a cut. Yeah, it is a cut. It's very well done, though. The blue, red especially is so well done. Like, I can barely tell. Also love the choreography again. I like this part. It's my favorite part. This is so pretty. The effects and the glitter. And it just looks so, like party but at the same time it looks angelic in, in a way it's it's awesome choreography again they added an element from another shot into this shot like setup into the setup nice yeah i do like the song i think again if i listen to it more i will like it even more but i think i like it i was just having trouble grasping where it was going the first time i really like the video love the choreography the lighting the cuts the editing um yeah, I like it a lot. That's all I have to say about Stay Tonight by Chung Ha. I hope this video was interesting or informative. I didn't really say too much, I feel like, but sometimes there's just not too much to say. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something or maybe you saw something that you didn't before. Thanks for watching. Bye.